let's start off with some CMs. Bro, that could have been the fucking Elder Mall. I, two twisted bows in 68 KC. Uh, someone is mad. Someone is mad, for sure. But I am also mad because I only need the Elder Mall to complete all the Mega Rares. I don't need a second twisted bow. I can't dual wield that shit. Finally, bro, 69 KC, and we finally got the received 10 chambers of Zerak Funi. Augury. Awesome. We take those because we actually haven't unlocked it yet. It's going to be nice for us. <sighs> Another fucking dex, man. That ain't do shit. And nothing. Third Twisted Buckler. Are you taking the fucking Michael? Finally, dude. One of the purples we actually needed. Dragon Hunter Crossbow. That's 125 points right there on the Bodhi number amount of raids as well. Bit of a crazy day at CM. So we've gotten more purples than we haven't. The drop rate is 1 in 5. So I think our luck is just catching up to it. Because obviously we've done loads of CMs. Woman Kisser's done like fucking 40 or something, got full Ancestral, which is 250 points, so, you know, the luck comes and goes. 125 points, 64,915, we'll come back to CMs later. Alright, we're going back to the Mage Training Arena, we're gonna go for a Mage's book, I think it might be one of the non-RNG tasks I can go for that might be sort of quick. Okay, I need to get 500 Telekinetic points, 550 Alchemist points, um, 6,000 Enchantment points, and 500 Graveyard points. Honestly, this is pretty chill when I did it last time, so I'm okay with doing this. And hopefully we can take rank 2. Okay, that's the telekinetic room done. We got 505 out of the 500 points we need. Let's move on to the alchemist room. Uh, we need 550 points from this room, and we have 2 currently. Alright, that's 554 alchemy possessed points, so that's more than enough for that. We're gonna move on to... Gonna move on to the enchantment now. It's the 6k enchantment points that we need. What's the last one? The graveyard or whatever? We'll go do that now. Alright, we got 500 of those graveyard possessed points. Let's go buy this mage's book. Unfortunately, Wolfie did just jump up like, I don't know, 30 minutes before I got this mage's book. Otherwise, we would have been able to tank, take rank 2. But you know what they say, it do be what it do be. We are now over 65,000 points. I'm happy with that myself. Still rank 3, about 400 points above Tom right now. Bro, I came here to edit and I finally got it. 610 KC, I just got the cudgel. That's 50 points right there. 65,090, damn it. I don't think I can edit anymore, bro. I need to try and go get another 50 points. Let's go, that's a Guthans War Spear right there. 25 league points equip a piece of any barrows armor set we just need to do three more chests and we get another 25 points and we take rank two carol's skirt as well nice and it is official we have done it we have done it we are rank two on the league points leaderboards 65,140 points i d i didn't expect to get here i really did not but i'm very happy with it managed to take over insane wolfie call myself insane dinner another titan overthrown for now and hopefully ever it's getting crazy now, the days get longer, the points get harder and slower, and we're in the final stretch. You guys have been with me since day one of this league, we didn't even have 100k subscribers yet. The support has been mental, but I'm not sure how many more videos I have left in me. Some days I'll just be doing tedious tasks like 16 hours of Brimhaven Agility, or 16 hours of Tempros, and I just can't make a video out of that. But there's definitely still a couple to go. All I can ask is that you help me feed my family of 300 children. The more subscribers I get per video is the best way to support my channel and get the video out there. Trust me, that is how the algorithm works. So really quickly, double checking that you are subbed would mean the world to me. I mean us, my whole family. I appreciate it, guys. Finally got rat catchers done. The first time we attempted it, we'd been up for 30 hours, so maybe that wasn't the smartest idea, but now we can actually get a bunch of the diaries done. 1,000 Lizardman Shaman kills, which is 25 league points. I let a Xerx Taman despawn earlier. Probably not my smartest idea because i need it for a task but that's awesome actually because i get the task done now all right that's 1250 lizard and shaman kills no d warhammer yet but this is very afk and there's also kc tasks that come with it also got the xerox talisman which i've let a couple d spawn so that's probably good for us let's go do a little combo breaker now we have 65 2050 because now we can put some lizardman fangs in this and we can put the ancient tablet on it and then we can rub it and go to xerox honor for the culture and get 50 points and wear it oh wait i need to wear it for another 25 points and i've just jumped up to 65,290, just like that all right that is win a game of castle wars we're back as rank three now oh uh, rank two my bad um i'm the best to ever do it uh let's go get started and work on these diaries again all right and that's the Fally medium diary done another 25 points there let's move on to the hard i think we're gonna need to do grim tales and maybe some other stuff all right that's grim tales completed which is nice so we can carry on with a Fally diary Okay, and that is the Fally Hard Diary done, which is another 50 points. We're gonna have to work on the Elite Diary done, uh, Elite Diary now, which requires like 1,200 Black Knight kills or whatever. Let's go claim, claim these rewards real quick. A little bit of runecrafting XP never hurt anyone. We're, what, maybe at 20 mil now? 
19.7 out of 25 mil. Okay, that's the final toss for the Faldor Elite Diary. Psych, we have to go kill how many? Um, it doesn't say there. I have to kill 1,200 Black Knight kills. We start with 100 rankings. So I have to kill 1,100. So I'm just going to get a cannon out and pretty much just click the cannon AFK a bit. Should take around two hours, I'm pretty sure. All right, we sit here with a cannon. We have auto retaliate and the blowpipe and the rigor on. We order some food and we chill out because we need to get 1,200 kills. Okay, surely now I can go buy this shit, right? Okay, this should now have a white twitch. Yes, let's go. I think that's the Fally Elite Diary, Don. I say I think. I know it is. 65,515 points now. Over 65.5k. Let's go cash in some RCXP2. Let's go runecrafting. Now at... What are we at? 20.5 mil XP. Damn, I just gained a casket from fishing. I'm working on the... What's it called? What am I doing? The Catherby... Catherby Candor and Easy Diary. Alright, that's the Easy Diary done. Another 5 points. And that's the Medium Diary done for another 25 points. We're all done. Let's go claim this XP. Alright, let's claim all this XP in runecrafting. Nice little 40k. 120k. 240k. And a solid 800k. Now what are we at? Uh, 21.7 mil. That's the Karen and Kebos Easy Diary done. Let's move on to the Medium. And that is the Karen and Kebos Medium Diary done now too. Another 25 points right there. Let's move on to the Hard. And that is the Karen and Kebos Hard Diary done. We've already done the Elite Diary obviously, so we're now done with that. 65,630 points now. Let's go cash in this XP. You'll be one of your reward then. Yo, I fucking hope so. I fucking hope so, Elise. Give me that shit. 6% this, 8% that. I don't know how to do math. So let's just get some runecrafting XP for the one time. 40k. 120k. 240k. Damn, there's some mass in there. Some multipliers. We're now at... Oh, that's construction. We're now at 23 mil almost runecrafting XP. We still got two diaries to complete. Lumbridge and Draenor, which requires all quests completed, and Mauritania, which I will require a full barrow set for. Is that the Lumbridge easy diary done? It is. Another five points off of that. Let's go on to the medium. And that is the medium diary done. I just realized I'm also going to need bones to peaches for the hard diary, which shouldn't take too long, honestly, with the relic. But that's 25 league points. 65,660 now. All right, I've done most of the diary stuff that I can do for now because obviously I need to go get Bones to Peaches and a Belladonna takes some time to grow. I could probably do the rest of the Elite stuff too so that once everything's in order, I can just get it all done really quickly. Obviously, I have to go do a bunch of quests. So yeah, we'll probably get this done some point, but I don't know how long the quest will take. Okay, so we're only missing a couple of them now is the Belladonna Seed, Bones to Peaches, and obviously performing the quest cape. I think I'll go work on getting Bones to Peaches right now actually. Okay, that is all the telekinetic points that we need. Let's go alchemist now. All right, I've got 300 alchemist points, which is eight more than we need. We need 2,000 enchantment and 200 graveyard now. And that is 200 graveyard points, so we just need to get the enchantment ones now. And that is 2,000 enchantment points. Let's go buy boons to peaches. All right, the guardian has taught us how to use the boons to peaches spell. How nice and dandy is that? Probably need some bones first, huh? Cast boons to peaches, 25 league points, 56,685 points. And my Atlanta time is ready for farming or for harvest. Let's go. Going to get started on a bit of questing that will get us some instant points, like the observatory quest, observatory quest, which will give me 25 points. And then we'll probably just go do some CMs. Get And that is the observatory quest done, 25 points, 1,097 tasks completed. And we're now at 65,710 points. In search of knowledge completed, it is some more room crafting. We have no idea how big this lamp is. 160k. Oh, we take that. Another 25 points. 65,735. Let's go do some CMs. Pull an Elder Mall. Pull Ancestral. Pull the Ancestral Kit. Pull the Pet in the Dust. And just go up a million points. I think that's a great plan. What do you guys think? And nothing. And nothing. And nothing. And nothing. And nothing. And nothing. Fucking finally, man. Ancestral hat. It's like the worst, worst piece to get, but it's 125 points. We haven't got a single piece of the Ancestral set yet. And that is equip any Ancestral piece for 125 points. Like I said, I don't think we're completing the full set. 65,860. Ideally, we'd like the Dragon Warhammer before we go to Corp. It's 1 in 1.66k from uh, Lizard and Shamans. I've killed 1.92k now, I'm at 65,910 points from uh, the 1500 Shaman kills. There's no more KC task for it, so it's literally just for the Dragon Warhammer. It is very AFK, but I'd like to get that Warhammer sooner rather than later. Alright, that's the Corsair Curse completed. I'm going to go check real quick that my Belladonna Seed's all good. Of course, bro, of course. Thank god, we brought it back to life, but it's only 2 out of 5. 
All right, and that's Imp Catcher done. Let's go Mistle and Mystery. And that is Mistle and Mystery done now too. And that's Witch's Potions done. I've got all the free-to-play quests done now. And that is Between a Rock completed. Got a Rune Pickaxe out of it. Awesome. All right, that's Clock Tower done too. All right, and that is Devious Mines completed. Some more XP, which really helps us out. Uh, I think we got like 10 quests or so to go. And that is getting ahead completed, like eight or nine more quests now. And that is a night at a theater done. Obviously didn't actually do the TOB shit because let's be honest, CBA doing that. Took a little time, a forgettable tale done though. That's Rag and Bone Man 1 completed. Time to do Rag and Bone Man 2. All right, I think that is finally Rag and Bone Man 2 completed. That was a lot of time. Um, do I want the helm or the bone sack? I don't fucking know, bro. Anyway, we can move on now. Scorpion catcher done. Nice. Alright, I'm doing Shades of Morden, I just wanted to get 100% Shades of Morden Sanctity while I'm doing it. 25 more points, 65,935. Alright, and that is Shades of Morden completed, only got a couple more now. And that is Troll Romance done, we already started a lot of it earlier. I think we only got What Lies Below and the new Goblin quest to go now. And that is What Lies Below, now let's go do this new quest, uh, the last one we have to do, Land of the Goblins. Alright, my Belladonna grew, so that's nice. And that is a hard task completed, 50 points right there, 65,985, let's go finish this final quest. And that is Land of the Goblins completed, if I'm not mistaken, we have a completed quest log now. Apart from, you know, the mini quest, but those don't count. Let's go get our quest cape. Alright, quest cape, oh, I've just teleported, why have I done that? Where has that even taken me? To the legends, I see. Okay, and that is the final elite task done in the Lumbridge Diary, 125 league points, 66,110 now. Let's go claim some uh, XP. 66,110 points, all diaries completed apart from Mauritania, and the highest rank I've ever been on in a league. Rank 2. Two weeks left now until the end, we're going to make a push for that rank 1, and I need your guys' support. Right now, for the sake of my 350 children all around the world, scroll down, subscribe to the channel, like that like button, and comment down below your words of wisdom. It takes them less than 10 seconds to do all of that, and it's free, but it puts food on the table for me and my family, so I can't thank you enough. I love you guys. I will see you in the next video. Thank you guys so much for watching.